Hello and welcome back to another Gameplay Classic video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download and install the FIFA mobile game on your Android device. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the Google Play Store from your device. And once you open it up, just tap on the search box. And now you can type in FIFA Mobile and start your search. Now, from the search results, just tap on the FIFA Mobile or the EA Sports FC game. And you will see the install button if you haven't installed it already. Just tap on this button and it will begin the download and installation of the EA Sports FC or the FIFA Mobile game on your device. Just wait for a while until the installation is completed. And when it is done, you will see the play button, which you can tap on in order to open up the game. And once the game is opened up, you can start your game immediately or log into your existing account to continue playing from where you left off before. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to download and install the FIFA mobile game on your Android device. In this video, I'm going to show you how to sign up and create a new account on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, when you open up the FIFA mobile game on your device, you will be taken through the basic tutorial levels. Once you have completed these levels, you can log in or sign up to an online account to link your progress. To sign up, tap on the gear icon at the top right corner and within link accounts, just tap on the link button. And now you will see the EA account, the Facebook option, as well as Google Play Games. You can use whichever option you wish to sign up for your game. Once you tap on your desired option, you will either need to log in to the respective account or sign up by creating a new one. If you use Facebook or Google Play Games, you can simply choose your respective account that you wish to use and it will be linked to your FIFA mobile game account right away. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to sign up and create a new account on the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how to log into your existing account on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the FIFA mobile game on your device. And after completing the basic tutorial levels, you will be taken into the homepage from which you can log into your existing account by tapping on the gear icon at the top right corner. Now you will see the link accounts option within which just tap on the link button and now you can link your EA account, your Facebook or your Google Play Games account in order to log in. Just choose whichever option you used to sign up for your account and after continuing forward with your profile and logging in using your credentials, you will be logged back into your FIFA mobile account and all of your previous progress will revert back as well. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to log into your existing account on the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the graphics settings within the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the FIFA mobile game on your device. And once you open it up, proceed through the basic tutorial levels. And after you complete them, you will gain access to the main menu. Now from this page, if you wish to make any changes to your game graphics, then tap on the gear icon at the top right corner. Now from this page, you will see the graphics option. Tap on the pen icon at the right side and now you can choose from various different graphical presets. You can tap on these presets for a quick adjustment or you can manually change the individual settings for resolution, frame rate, post effects, crowds as well as UI effects. After choosing your desired option, tap on the save button and the game will restart in order to make your desired change. Once the game has restarted, your graphic changes will be applied to your game right away. And there you have it, that is how easy it is to change the graphical settings on the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can update the FIFA mobile game application on your smartphone. So let's get started right away. Now, if the game is not automatically updating on your device, then in order to do this manually, just open up the iOS App Store or the Google Play Store, depending on your device. Once you open it up, just tap on the search box and then type in FIFA mobile and start your search. Once you find the EA Sports FC game application, just tap on it. And if you see an update button instead of play, you will need to tap on this button to download the latest updates for the game. After tapping on this button, just wait for a little while until the installation is completed. And when it is done, you will once again see the play button, which means that the game has already been updated. If you now tap on this play button and start the game, you will notice that the latest updates are already installed and the game will run smoothly. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to update the FIFA mobile game on your device. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the audio and commentary language on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the FIFA mobile game on your device. And once you open it up, 
After completing the basic tutorial levels, you will gain access to your home screen. From here, tap on the gear icon at the top right corner and you will be taken to the settings page. Within this page, underneath customization, you will see the commentary and SFX option. Tap on the edit button at the right side. And now you can download the stadium atmosphere sound effects as well as choose the commentary language. Tap on the download button at the right side for the language pack that you want to download and then tap on the start button. This will now begin the download of the language pack for the language that you just selected. Once it has been downloaded, just tap on it to enable the language. And now when you start playing your matches, you will notice that the commentary and audio will all appear in the language that you just selected. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to change the audio and commentary language on the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find out your level on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. Now, when you open up the FIFA mobile game on your device, you will be taken through the basic tutorial levels, after which you can log into your account by tapping on the gear icon at the top right and then by clicking on link accounts. From here, you can use your EA account, your Facebook or your Google Play Games account to log in to your account. Once you are logged in, you can go back to the home page and if you wish to check your level, just tap on your user ID at the top left corner. This will then take you to the player profile menu where you will be shown your overall level. Now underneath OVR, you will be shown your team strength and just underneath your username, you will find your current level, which can also be considered as your experience. This will also have various different categories in which you can have various different kinds of scores. You can improve your level and your score by playing additional matches and winning and you can use the experience increase to increase your level as well. And there you have it. That is how you can check your level within the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the language on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the FIFA mobile game on your device. And once you open it up, complete the basic tutorial levels if you haven't done so already. Once you gain access to the main menu, if you wish to change the language, just tap on the gear icon at the top right corner. This will then take you into the settings page within which you will see the language menu. Tap on the edit icon at the right side and now you will have the option to choose your desired language from the list of available ones. You also have the option to use whatever system language you are using. You can change from this by simply tapping on your desired language. Once you choose your language, tap on the continue button and this will restart your game and take you back into the main menu with your chosen a preferred language. And you can go back to this menu as many times as you want to change your language within your game. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to change the language within the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change your jersey on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the FIFA mobile game and complete through the basic tutorial levels and you will be allowed to select a team as your home team to start playing your games. Now, when you continue to play the game, you will gain various different rewards, which also includes different jerseys. Now, if you wish to use these jerseys within a match, then just tap on the club menu from the home page. From this page, tap on locker room and you can just tap on the kit option in order to choose from the various different kit of jerseys that are available. You can choose this as a home or an away jersey. So after making your choice, tap on the confirm button and now your change will be applied and this kit will be chosen for your team. You can also customize your kit and your jersey by tapping on the appearance option and make various different changes. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to change the team jersey within the FIFA mobile game. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change your team on the FIFA mobile game. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the FIFA mobile game on your device. And when you play the game for the first time, you will be asked to choose a team. If you have already chosen a team, but you wish to change it later on within the game, then just tap on the club menu from the home page. Now from here, tap on the locker room option and then tap on a home team. You will now be able to choose from the various different teams as your home team. Just tap on the team that you wish to select and then tap on the select button. And now your team will be changed within the FIFA mobile game right away. You can also change various other information such as the number of your players as well as the kit that you are going to use. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to change your home team on the FIFA mobile game. If you find this video helpful, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. Also ring that notification bell to never miss another update from us. Thank you for watching and I will see you again in the next video.